My name is Elsie. Um, once I became into probably when I was about 14, my dad, he uh, started becoming mentally ill. Uh, he was diagnosed with schizophrenia and manic bipolar and depression. It was really hard on me and so I, I started to drink and I was drinking for probably about four to five years and I kept waking up um, and I was noticing things that weren't right. Um, my dad, he started talking to me weird and he started becoming really weird towards me and I was, I was scared. I stopped drinking because I didn't want to keep going to sleep because I knew he was raping me in my sleep. After a year and a half worth of him doing these things to me, all of a sudden my dad felt bad and he told my mother what he was doing and he called the cops on himself. After when he was put away, the pain was so bad. I just, I couldn't even handle all the chaos. It completely, it destroyed my mother and father's marriage. It ruined my life. I couldn't stop having dreams of what happened to me. I, I started using methamphetamine to cope with it, to numb my pain. I uh, moved in with this guy at the age of 19 after when my father went to jail and uh, it was an abusive relationship. The abuse was getting so bad, um, uh, I finally decided to defend myself. Um, and then I was uh, put into jail because he called the police on me and I was going to face a year in prison um, for a felony aggravated battery. I felt like I did encounter God when I was in jail because he was saying, Elsie, I felt like he told me, what are you doing? You know, you're wasting all these years. You're holding in all this bitterness. I was put on probation. I was released after two weeks. And I, if I went into the program of Teen Challenge, that I would not have an aggravated battery felony on my record, that I would only have a misdemeanor assault. But, I, you know, I'm so glad that I was put into Teen Challenge because it changed my life. It was so incredible and getting to know God in the Bible, it's such a good thing that I'm here. I have a lot of hope for my future. Um, I've already been six months into my recovery and I never thought I could, I never thought I could do that. I'm just trying to do what God wants me to do each and every day. I know that things are gonna be better for having him come into my life. Thank you.